All right, guys, it's day five. So I figured out that every video is not gonna be like something fun, exciting, and it's not gonna be like Christmassy, I don't think. So I just figured if I come on every day for the next 25 days, at least, I can say I'm participating, right? <laughs> I think as I get closer and like some videos, I'll be able to do some some activities. Right now, it's mostly shopping and, you know, getting the house in order and, you know, I've been working so hard to be honest. I've been, I'm barely maintaining my day-to-day -day chores with, oh, you're gonna need a diaper, I forgot about that. Um... So we will see if you guys have not checked out the giveaway video, um, make sure you go do that. So, because I hope that it reached the number of views by the weekend or so, so that I can go ahead and do that one little piggy out um wait this baby <laughs> what if I kept the same babies for ever <laughs> you guys would know how to handle it I would think you guys would know how to handle it like seriously because look at this foot I love this foot let me show y'all something Shut up, shut up. I love, I love, wait, 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 let me, look, look at this foot, I love the veining in her foot, I don't know, let's see if you guys can see it, oh my gosh, it's so cute, I love it, I don't know why, but, oh my gosh, I love, I love, I love, love, love this baby, apparently so, she hasn't left yet, <laughs> um, what am I gonna say, oh, I love all my babies. That's the funny part. Everybody's like, oh my gosh, she get on my nerves. She's always like, oh, I love this one. I'm not going to sell this one. And then boom, so-and-so is up for sale. So-and-so is gone. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I just, I have babies coming in and then I fall in love with them. And then I, then I get a new baby and I fall in love with that baby. And then I say, lady, you cannot keep them all. And then I have to choose. And then usually, a lot of times, it's the newer one. But for whatever reason, with Gigi, every time a new baby come in, I still love her. <laughs> like, <laughs> and now that crazy behind Christopher Robin is trying to take over. He's trying to. He's trying to take over. I don't know. A lot of people boost their babies up just so they can sell them and all that and stuff but I generally genuinely have an addiction to collecting these babies I just want them all I just want them all hey poop okay so all right so let me just say something really quick I just want to say this um when dealing with armatures, you know, I see like a lot of artists, I see a lot of collectors, and I have been told that you're supposed to hold it when you bend it. I think it's so unnatural for me to have to do that. So, I mean, I'm not, I, I don't like to have to be doing it. I feel like I'm working a machine in that case. Um, and if it's so hard to maneuver, it would scare me. Um... I genuinely just, I don't really use my, use the armatures a lot, but when I do, I just, you can kind of feel a little bit and I just move them. I'm not pulling them. I'm not pushing them too far or trying to do anything awkward with them. I just, I just move them. Okay. There you go, baby. All right, I really think you need on a different diaper, but we're not gonna worry about that. We're gonna take her hat off. Y'all know she's like partially rooted. 
like most of my babies her silicone is so soft <laughs> oh my goodness <laughs> curly hair is wild oh I can't wait you know and that's the other thing I hardly ever have babies with hair and I just can't wait to have some babies that you know that's painted by me and rooted by me and that I get to keep in my collection it's just it's going to be so nice because I'm going to finish rooting her once I get through with these last order orders and I'm going to root Nori. Those are going to be my two next ones. I'll probably even root them before I do Brady because I'm not in a rush to get rid of Brady, which is Christopher Robin. So I'm probably going to finish Gigi because Gigi is probably the most got the most progress in her hair. So I'm going to probably finish her and then I'm going to. Um, and and I'll I'll do Nori, but it just helps when I don't have to put them on, so I don't have to put them on like hats. That's that's the big thing. So they can wear any outfit, and I don't have to be like, do I have a hat that matched that outfit? Like it's outfits that like I'm like they can't wear because of this now this. The pants leg on this is pretty tight. So in this case with silicone, this is the difference. Here's the difference. With vinyl, it wouldn't make much difference. But with silicone, those little crinkles are going to, they will leave an indent if I leave that up on her silicone for a long period of time. All right, baby. But just for the video purposes, just to see what it's going to look like. And I'm going to actually take it off even in the video. Um, she looks so cute. <laughs> and I know this is a, um, like a, for you to, ch like a bath or change their diaper type situation. But I... I think this open up in the back. This. I am going to. Uh, I like the back. I like the color in how the baby's uh, skin tone pop up against it. So that's why I, I've been leaving it on the bobby for the last couple babies. Okay. All right. So she can work neutral colors. Um, I think this goes in the back like that, and then this goes in the front. I never know about these bonnet things. There we go. All right. I just want to see what this looks like. I'm going to take this off of her because of the pants. I don't trust them. If I pull them up further, this part off the leg. It's a little something better, but... Mm. Now, who would have thought to put this baby on blue socks? Me! Put them on, put her on blue socks. Break some of this, give us some. Now, <laughs> I will put her on that, but let's see. I'll put her on this shoe. I will put her on. This shoe. <laughs> Y'all better stop playing with me with my dress code, baby. I I got this. <laughs> okay, maybe I can open this up. Yeah. 
So you gotta kind of with silicone, you gotta kind of feel because it's soft and make sure it's not balled up. And I would literally put, her, I think I would put on this one because I like, I like the way it looked on her foot. Oh my goodness! <laughs> look at, look at this. Look at that. Wait. There we go. <laughs> oh, shucks, man. Let me, let me let this light down a little bit. All right. Okay, baby. Come through, little Pippi. Oh, and I got this pacifier, but it's in the room. I left it in the room. I forgot. Cause that would have been so cute on her. This is so cute. I hate that she can't keep these pants on. Oh, but I got another, I got a blue diaper cover or a rust colored one. Maybe. These socks is kind of big for her feet. It's probably like taller socks. <laughs> it's okay. We gonna make it work. We gonna make it work. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay, I hate that I have to take her off these, um, these pants, because then I have to take her off the socks. But let's see, maybe I got another outfit that I can swap her out in. Oh, I know this is the end of the video, but baby, can I say that I am up waiting for the pre-order for uh, Otili by Cassie Brace? Here's my thing, baby, I am celebrating the, I got these little shoes from um, Linda's collection. I bought like a ton of the shoes from there. Um, here, here's my thing. I want to normalize smaller collections again, like, I mean, uh, edition size and, um, the limited editions it's it it's giving me the whole open edition thing it's not solving anything obviously people are still copying stuff so my thing is for the real collectors out here and i shouldn't say it like that but you know what i mean for people that collect for odd things let's say it let's word it that way or rare um, I, I just wish we could have more, mm -mm. I wish we could have more, more of limited editions. I, I absolutely do not pre-order anymore because of the, the open editions or the 5,000 in edition, might as well say it's open, type edition. Um, and I, I feel like this. I feel like a lot of the sellers should even see the difference in their sales. I don't think they sell as much when they do the open edition, to be honest. I really don't. I think people trickle in and buy here or there versus when it's a limited edition, a very limited edition people run out and everybody buy it and the kids sell out or whatever the case may be and if even if it's 500 or 800 they sell that many here's the thing when they do open editions they don't sell that many you know why because people don't care to rush to go buy something that's gonna be there for a hundred years and people don't care about buying it either at the same price 
as getting something limited that they don't have to worry about everybody having it on their timeline. So I definitely think that I'm definitely supporting people who do smaller editions and and I ain't talking about the ones that, oh, it's small today, but we're going to come back with a second version of this kit two months later. And then that's what they don't understand. That's to me, that that helps the scammers more to me because when we see knockoffs on kits that's like out here that never came back, we don't know if that was a second edition. When we see it, we don't be like, that kit been long sold out. Why is it being sold right now? No, we're like, oh, well, maybe she did a second edition because she does a second edition with all her babies. Or, you know, the kit been going on. It's, it's just, yeah, it's 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 not given. Um, so, anyway, I'm going to get this girl changed into something else. I just thought I would see how this look on her. And it looks fine, but this is too small so I'm gonna have to use this on a smaller baby or one of my vinyls because the the pants leg is just too tight for silicone and I don't want those crinkles in her silicone so so we will go and we will see you guys later I maybe need to do a whole separate video on that that subject but not really because I don't care I'm just talking whatever it is what it is people gonna buy what they want to buy and do what they want to do it and i don't have to buy it right so there's that but anyway let me go so i can get my <laughs> pre-order in or kit because i think it's actually ready to go ready to ship something like that